Hello, I am Giovanni Virgilio, Superintendent of Schools for the Roman Catholic Diocese of Albany. As we prepare to begin the new school year, I want to take a moment to personally thank you for your commitment to Catholic education, to welcome back our returning students and families, and to offer a warm welcome to our new friends who are joining us for the first time this year. As I thought about the first day of school, I considered the power of perception and a positive mindset. How we perceive the world around us influences not just how we see things, but more importantly, what we see. Do we see the challenges that we can overcome and grow from, or roadblocks that hold us back? Former National Geographic photographer DeWitt Jones spent decades capturing beautiful images of nature and people around the world. He noted that beauty and opportunity were, quote, always there if I was open enough to see it. Our Catholic faith reminds us of just that. We do not look at the crucifixion of our Lord as a day of sadness or defeat, but rather as the ultimate act of love to all of us and the prelude to the magnificent resurrection. There is good all around us, and by celebrating what is right in the world and in our communities, we open ourselves to seeing God's grace. Each person's attitude, the mindset an individual brings to the table, can make all the difference in the world. This powerful tool is within each of us and can be especially helpful as we continue to respond to the COVID-19 pandemic. The idea of seeing what our hearts and minds are prepared to see can prepare us for success no matter what change or challenge is put before us. We cannot predict or control the future, but we can prepare both physically and mentally to make the most of the days, months, and years ahead. All of us in Catholic education strive always to better ourselves personally, professionally, spiritually, and academically. It is part of why our schools were able to achieve and maintain system accreditation and why we look forward to the reaccreditation process in the spring of 2022. The team of reviewers will affirm our commitment to continuous improvement and ensure we are meeting or exceeding the accreditation standards we met five years ago, the first diocese in the state to achieve this noble distinction. This process will also afford us the opportunity to set our strategic goals and priorities for the future, charting the path to ever increasing levels of higher powered learning. We are blessed to start each September with a fresh slate, an opportunity for renewal that allows us to bring forward the successes we achieved last year and leave behind any difficulties or distractions that weighed us down in the past. In closing, success builds upon success and I am ready for the most successful school year yet. Are you? When your perception of the world allows you to see opportunities for success, there is no limit to what we can achieve. Thank you.